I'm not available for anything that is not mutually beneficial. Mm -hmm. Like nothing. Yeah. Like not in work, not in home, not in friendship. So for me, I don't think I'm ever pouring for an empty cup because I say no all the time. I say no all the time, you know, and I'm also not going to be moved by someone using tactics on me that are usually coping mechanisms like guilt or people pleasing or like, let me ask you a few different ways. I'm not available for that. I'm not judging you because yeah. that's the tools that you're pulling from, mm -hmm. but it's still no. And so be okay with that or not, but it's okay for me. What's up, y'all? It's 1028 Awakenings, and I'm back again with another motherfucking video. What's going on, Scorpios? I hope y'all out here looking good, feeling good, and smelling good. All right, y'all. So, let's see what's going on in the grid today. We are going through a solar eclipse, which just basically means, like, shit is about to hit the fan in a good way, and shit is hitting the fan in a bad way. Well, what we perceive to be bad, you know. Shit got to fall away that, you know, no longer serves us. But anyway, Scorpios, what's going on? I love to hear from you guys. You guys are the bomb. I love to read all the messages. Okay, they really make me excited. I'm so happy about them. So let's just dive into this reading, okay? All right, Scorpios, dang. Okay, coming out the gate, you're going through a transformation where somebody is. Things are about to change in your life, okay? Damn, someone is getting a tarot card reading on you okay so if you are a tarot card reader you're about to go through a huge transformation in your life if you are not a um, tarot card reader somebody that you thought was not going to turn into a motherfucking butterfly is about to go through a goddamn upgrade and turn into a motherfucking bu butterfly okay um this person could be watching your tarot card readings all right if you are a tarot card reader but let's get the kipper on it and see what the fuck going on with this tarot card reader okay someone has been getting a reading done on you okay some of you guys are tarot card readers some of you guys have tattoos on your right arm okay your person may have a tattoo on their forearm which is an awkward place to have a tattoo but i mean i just gotta tell you what i'm saying okay tell you, tattoo okay Okay, so somebody is going through a transformation, okay? Um, all right, bottom of the deck, energy, house, upside down. Okay, so somebody's going through a transformation. This person could be a teller card reader, okay? You're going on a journey recently. You could have moved out of your house. You could have packed up your bags and moved to a new place, okay? Also, someone outside of you, Scorpio, is going through a major transformation. You may be a... Um, tarot card reader this person could be packing up their bags and leaving a house and coming towards you okay we got a couple here in the distance horizons okay so maybe somebody could have dreamed about you know being with someone here because they're like back far away and this man is by himself okay so i just feel like scorpio somebody outside of you could be going through a major transformation especially if you are a tarot card reader okay they have been watching your tarot card readings okay and they are leaving their house okay they're going on a journey um and only they're leaving okay so somebody only a masculine energy is leaving or only a, male, a female, feminine energy is leaving their house okay um they could have thought that they were going to be with someone for a really long time but they're in the distance here so something could have faded away okay and it's all because somebody misses you scorpio somebody really misses you all right and um i think scorpio you felt like this was the end okay but we're not going to take that all right because you know it wasn't at the bottom of the deck energy okay so we got i miss you somebody's going through a major transformation they could have went to a tarot card reader and got a tarot card reading on you and they could have said that you're going down a new journey scorpio the tarot card reader could have told them that you're moving out of your house and you're going somewhere this this tarot card reader could have told this person that you're going through major transformations and that you really miss this person okay they could have got a reading and that tarot card reader could have told them that all right so let's see what the hidden truth is, Scorpio, behind like what the fuck is going on with this person. Or if this is you packing up your bags, going on a train. How do you feel? All right. Let's see what's going on with my Scorpios. All right. Um. Okay. So this person could be having tower moments. All the cards fell. I know you don't feel the same way. I know. I don't know what comes next. Okay. So I feel like this person may have been 
somewhere else, okay? And, or they just have been chilling, okay? Because this person just looked like they're chilling, okay? And they feel like they don't think you care anymore, okay? So somebody feels like you went through a transformation. You could be a tarot card reader. You moved, you went on a new journey. This person really misses you. And they feel like you don't even give a fuck about them anymore. Uh, they really don't know what comes next because I feel like this person haven't really said a lot to you, okay? They have distanced their self away from something here, okay? Maybe the idea of you guys being together or something like that. Maybe they were fighting it because they keep making me look at these two people in the different horizons, okay? Um, but this person thinks about how, like... They don't know how you feel, okay? This person could be watching your social media and they could possibly feel like you have moved on. They really don't know what comes next, but they're not really saying anything. They're just kind of being stuck in their head. This is somebody who psychoanalyzes things like way too much. You know, this is somebody who's all, all up in their head a lot. Um, Scorpio, you could have went through a major transformation. You could have moved recently out of your house. You could have moved into a new house. You could live in a new place at this time. Um... Also, somebody could be getting kicked out of their house um, because they want to be with a tarot card reader, <laughs> okay? And they miss this tarot card reader and um, they don't know what to do, okay? So what else is going on in this connection, all right? So children are important in this partnership. It's upside down, okay? So this person still wants to be a good father or a good mother or there are no kids in this situation, okay? So somebody could be a tarot card reader, and they could be dating somebody that they're with. Their relationship went through a major transformation. This person doesn't want to live together anymore. Yeah, marriage in reverse, okay? So we could have someone who is basically getting a divorce, okay? Or we could have two couples here that have been together for a really long time. There's never been a higher level of commitment. This person has never had kids with you, okay? But you just feel like it's time for you to leave. You feel like you can't live in the house with this person anymore, you know, you really miss and reminisce about the old times, but for the most part, you've changed, okay? During this relationship, you may have started out being a butterfly, but now you, I mean a caterpillar, but now you have transformed into a beautiful butterfly. Some of you guys are tarot card readers and... You know, this whole tarot card reading experience has really taken you down a new journey. You're definitely financially independent, okay? And you may have even bought a new house. Some of you guys could be a single parent, never married as well. Um, you know, I feel like what I miss you, there is someone that you miss here, Scorpio, okay? Um, they're also longing for you as well, but they're suppressing their energy here with longing for you in reverse. So someone is longing for you. Someone does want to communicate with you, but they're stopping their self from doing so, all right? Um, that's a lot of different timelines. That's really cool. This video might get a lot of views because that was kind of crazy. Anyway, you guys are going through a major transformation, crowning a read. Some of you guys are about to become tarot card readers. Some people are actually going to other tarot card readers on you. They're getting tarot card readers on tarot card readings on you. Um, somebody didn't offer you no new love. So somebody who just moved into a new house or someone who's about to get kicked out of the house. Um, they didn't extend their love offer to you. Okay. They could be getting kicked out of their house very soon here. Somebody could be getting kicked out. Okay. Their whole life could be transforming. It's all because they wanted to hold on to a fake persona of their self. Okay. It is also because this person would not release their ex. Their ex was toxic. This was something that this person was supposed to release, but they just did not because of fear, um, because of a uh, lack of transformation. Now they're being forced to do it. There was a lot of deception here. Okay. Um, this person could have wanted to tell the truth, but didn't. Okay. This person just wanted things to say the same. Where religious factors here, Scorpio, you could really be a tarot card reader or a Reiki healer or some kind of spiritual blah, blah, blah. Um, this person could have met you, fell deeply in love with you. And because of that, this person did not offer you a new level of commitment. They wanted things to stay the same. I, this has been a storyline that's been coming up a lot. Okay. But now everything in this person's world is tumbling down. They will be getting kicked out of the house. They need to release this ex. It's very toxic. Deception is here. 
So with deception here, your person could have got cheated on. So if this is a man, his wife could have cheated on him publicly and everybody knows. OK, um, this person could have been a high like, oh, I'm, you know, I'm a Christian woman. I'm a Christian man. Uh, da, 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 da. They could have been exposed for that. So this person could have been like a big time Jesus or Bible thumper type person. But it's been publicly exposed that their outside spouse has cheated on them. Um, your person could be kicking your person, um, their person out of the house. OK. Um, your person, their person may know about you with new love in reverse, but your person never took any action on you. I feel like this is your person thinking about you in the horizon. Like, I wish I could do that, but I can't because, you know, I would destroy my home or, you know, I don't want to leave my husband or something like that. But it seemed like this happened anyway. This could be the one is in reverse. So whoever they invested in, whether this be you, Scorpio, that was some boo ooh, ooh shit. Okay. So whoever that was that you thought was your forever was actually your for not. OK, damn, Scorpio. I mean, you know, things happen, you know, it's, it's good for you to know the lesson now. Um, no reason to beat yourself up about it if this is a Scorpio. OK, um, but, you know, if they did turn someone else down for you, for someone else, just know that they are longing for you now. OK. Okay, so Scorpio, this person had to recenter themselves. They had to like have a wake up call and re-examine their life because they were going in the wrong direction here. 666. They have to be very tactful about how they're going to go about this situation with you because they walked away from something that they really shouldn't have walked away from because they were holding on to the past. This person has to now be brave. It's time for this person to move on and let go of old habits. I told you. Okay, so this person is now trying to be brave. All right. This person does think about how they weren't generous with you. They didn't give to you and you guys didn't have a harmonious relationship. Bye, Scorpio. See y'all next time.